What is going on guys, this is Ben here, bringing you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, we have the tanks. We're gonna be maxing them out right now. Finally have them maxed, because I literally just, they were like the last troop that I had maxed in the game. Well, actually the Grenadiers were, um, but then all the recent new upgrades, we had to get them upgrading again. So we're gonna do the instant finish. The reason why I'm doing the instant finish is so I have gold to attack still and everything like that. And then uh, we'll see the difference here. We have their health is 6,650, and then their damage is 556. So that's a pretty monster tank right there, especially with the boost that I have. I have the health boost and the damage, and then GBE and. Oof! Don't want to hit that, and then GBE. I still really haven't used the statue storage. Uh, I don't really know if I'll be using it unless I seriously get a good, like, either an amazing resource reward statue, and I want to save it for later. Or a, um, a super boss ice statue or something like that. Because otherwise I really want the power potter for when I reclaim my masterpieces and stuff like that. But either way, we have the all tanks trained up for the all maxed attacks. Let's get into it. Uh, we have some players up in here. With level 58, I can get my supply chest today as well. Um, hopefully, no failures. So for today's though, today's video though, we're going to take out the boom cannons for sure. Um, he just have his he just has his rockets boosted up, which isn't a big deal for us, which is good because he's probably not expecting people to have all tanks against him. So we're just gonna take out this boom cannon for sure, and then after that we'll maybe shock the boom cannons. I don't know. So let's take it out because our our tanks can take a hit or two with the boosted up ice or not the ice statue the um the boosted up health statue. So. Oh, uh, we're since we're gonna be going on the left hand side. I'm just gonna take out this shock launcher here Just so it doesn't slow down my troops that much. I'm actually gonna reposition my mic a little bit And you guys may notice the next couple days I'm gonna be wearing my mob crush shirt uh, That's because I'm recording these in, a, in, a, in like a big go here Going on this going on a trip soon Don't know when I can mention what it is, but I'm gonna have to have some pre-recorded videos for you guys again soon because I literally last week I just got back from um, or a couple days ago I just got back from uh, California so yeah see how much GB I'll have left though 40 left we're gonna take out this boom cannon for sure then we're going to shock these cannons because those cannons actually do hurt quite a bit and the boom cannon but once we get once oh my gosh and the boom mines we gotta throw down some critters here go to the boom mines and just look at the damages, boys. Like the even if you upgraded it, <laughs> upgraded it, it, upgraded the tanks. Um, just the, like the little bit, and you boost your statues. It actually helps out a lot. Like the percentages of the boost is crazy. So tanks were strong before, and having them upgraded now even more, they're even stronger. Uh, we just completely annihilated this guy here. Uh, we only lost a couple tanks, and. In combination with the new GBEs, the abilities, the tanks, they're just so, so strong. We're still looking for a crystal, man. Come on. Give me the crystals, boys and girls. But we're going up against a Time. That'd be so cool if his name was Tim. But we're going up against a almost max level player. He does, he has a little bit of ice probably up in here somewhere. Damage 37% and health 30%. Okay. So this guy's a little rough, let's see, a lot of boom cannons, I don't see a doom cannon though, so that's a good thing, so we'll, we should be fine here. He's got some higher level cannons though, hmm, we'll take care of this shock launcher and the boom cannon here, I'm gonna shock those two when we get to it, so we're gonna take out these three. Then we'll take out this boom cannon back here. Let's go the shock launcher with the mine. All right. Uh, for now, I think that's good. Yeah, we'll just drop them. We'll drop them. See how it goes. We don't have medics with us, so it's gonna be pretty much us just managing our our placements. So here we go. Let's take it out. Uh. I kind of want to do take out these boom cannons, but I don't have the GBE for it just yet. Once we can, mm, I'll go for it. We'll go for this one. So I'll hit the mortar as well, and that'll give me some more GBE too. And that almost took it out, and then there we go. We'll take it out right now with that artillery shot. Okay. So now we have some cannons to worry about. Uh, the one, the two boom cannons still. 
Another cannon right here. Uh, I'm going to reposition a little bit soon here just to avoid those two. We'll go over here. We're losing a little bit of tanks, but we still have a lot, a lot, like a lot of them alive here. We're going to get rid of this shock launcher in the back. That might be a little bit more than enough with those artillery shots. Yeah, that was actually just the right amount. Just the right amount. Will this shot hit those boom cannons? Yes, it will. Okay. So this is looking good for us. We're going to get this victory here, I can already tell. Because uh, I can just keep these boom cannons shocked, and they're actually going to go down fairly quickly here. There we go, there we go. And boom. Took it down. Took it down in time. Tim time. Tim time rolling over the bases. But we did not get a crystal. <laughs> this time we only lost four tanks, so that was better attack than the last one too. All right, keep on rolling here. We're one away from the super from the super supply chest. <laughs> we got level 54 down here. We could completely annihilate this guy, but I don't think that would be very courteous. We'll go against General here, General Zhao. No, actually I don't. Want, uh, we'll, mm, uh, we'll attack him. We'll, uh, we'll 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 do it. We'll do it. We'll take out the general here. If he doesn't have any boom cannons. Okay, sweet. Well, he does have boom cannons. I meant doom cannons. So we're actually going to take out these three buildings right here. And one go with our barrage. We'll take out the sawmill. Actually, we'll, we'll start another barrage too. So it should take out the shock launcher and them. There we go. That was worth it. And then we'll barrage in between here. It helps clear the mines. Take out the boom cannons that we need. Hit that shock... A shock mine there as well. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, dude, that thing is so dead. Oh, we'll leave it. We'll leave it for now. Um, hopefully like a bird like poops on it and then it dies or something. I don't know. Or a monkey throws like a, a banana at it. Actually, the monkeys don't show up in these trees, I don't think. It only shows up on your base. But we're just going to drop our troops for now and see what needs work. And this guy's got some pretty weak defenses. Barrage away this. Maybe he's a he's a new no he's this HQ21. But we'll take out this. I could have got the double hit on the residence there. I just so I just noticed that. Take out this boom cannon. All right. So now all the major boom cannons are destroyed. All this is pretty much gonna be a wreckage crew right here. If I boost my GB statues, and can take out that much stuff. Oh my goodness! Look out! These tanks are gonna be a force to be reckoned with. Um, even if you are like have a ton of ice, it's still gonna be super super tough. But the boom mine we hit, we're gonna hit and cut. We're gonna encounter a couple more boom mines. I'm actually gonna throw some critters just to keep my casualties maybe a little bit lower. We're gonna reposition here. The tanks are on the move, and then we're just gonna barrage away all this junk up in here. This was a really easy attack here. I'm glad we took down the general. We'll just throw down some med kits because we can, and this HQ is going to melt really, really quickly. And boom, there we go. It's a good attack. Can we please get a crystal boom beach? Please, boom beach. Yes, dude. Let's go, man. I haven't, I haven't been able to call that forever. Let's go, dude. I haven't got a crystal in a video in a couple, a week or two. Thank gosh, man. So we'll take it. I don't lose any tanks that attack, so we'll do one more. Um. Hmm. Where are you? Where are you, player bases? I'm uh, I'm running out of them. Does he have a lot of resources? If he doesn't have a lot of resources, we're gonna scout a new one. Actually, he's got a decent amount of resources, and he's boosting ice, and he has a doom can. This is even though he's level 55, he's a lot weaker than the other players I was attacking. This guy actually has boosted ice. The Doom Cannon. Uh, so this is going to be very interesting. We'll see if the tank strategy can actually hold up against this. But his base is pretty spread out though. So that is kind of good for us. Kind of isn't. Uh, we'll see. Take out this. Okay. So we just wasted a lot of GBE to take out that one. Oh, we'll take out this Shock Launcher as well. Shock launchers are annoying, man. Slow down everything. Okay. We'll drop the tanks up in here. And we really don't have a lot of GBE. 
left. So after this shock is about to shoot, I'm going to throw on another shock. Just to take out the boom cannon, and then hopefully take out the shock launcher at the same exact time before the shock runs out. Alright, we're not going to worry too much about the cannons. The tanks are doing a good job getting through the base. We have a lot of free GBE we could acquire on the sides of the base. But we're just going to actually barrage away this. Probably went a little overboard again. I think I did with our two with our double artillery shots. Uh, we're going to stick to this side though because that's more of the HQ side. We don't really need to worry about those cannons and boom cannons. We're about this cannon up in here. And after this cannon, I said cannon like cannon, 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 cannon like seven times in a row. Hashtag cannon. Um, <laughs> which Naruto is not canon at the moment. For those of you that get the reference, you know what I mean. But, um, now I completely lost what I was saying. I don't know. Either way, we're taking down the base. We could get a lot of free GBE over there, but it's not necessary. We can win over here. Once that cannon went down, there's literally nothing that can really take out the tanks in a, a, a big fashion or big, or like a good way. Um, so either way, GG on this attack. We'll just keep that shock because we can. And can we get two crystals in a row, Boom Booch? Can we get two crystals in a row? I don't know. We'll see in the next episode. Hey, we got a prototype module. We'll take it. He was boosted. Only lost two tanks that time. The level 55. So there you have it. I can open my chest here. And we're going to take the shards for sure. Nice. And we got some intel. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So, either way, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like you did, and don't forget to subscribe for more Boom Beach videos not ready. Max tanks are pretty strong, I'm not gonna lie. T -t Tank medic is probably stronger too, but with the medics getting the buff. But upgrading these honestly doesn't do too much. Um, their healing per second is only one health point more, so. But they have more health, like hit points. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like did, don't forget to subscribe for more Boom Beach videos not ready. It was a wonderful day night, and I'll see you guys later.